In this video, you're going to learn how to bring together your ground floor and your top floor for your architectural model. And you can see here I've got both of my uh, ground floor and you can see I've indicated it's the ground floor by making the ground around it green. And this is my top floor and this is a balcony I've added onto the front and I've just coloured that brown for ease of use. So the first thing I'm going to do is I uh, click on my selection tool and control A in my ground floor to select all of it, right click and I'm going to make it a group. So now if I move anything it should all move together um, and using the move tool just like your pieces of furniture it should all just move as one component. I'm going to do exactly the same thing to the upstairs. I'm going to make sure the selection tool is selected, control A to select all, right click, make group. Now this one's completely selected going to control C to copy it, go back to the ground floor, control V to paste and you can see that my model has come in attached to my cursor um, and it will go to any of the points that I want to locate it on. And I actually want it to line up something at the front here and across here but because I can't do it exactly I'm just going to zoom in and I'm going to line it up with this end point in the group here. If I zoom out and orbit, you'll notice that it's not quite the right size here and it's probably a little off at the front and the back as well. So before I do anything else I'm just going to align this front corner here with this edge which is where I want them to line up. So orbiting around you can see that that's correctly aligned on that front corner there but it still needs to be resized here on the side and at the back as well. So the next thing I need to do is go to Tools, Scale. And just like when you were scaling your windows and your doors and possibly some of your furniture as well, you can scale this group that you've made. So clicking on Scale, I'm going to grab this handle here. I want it to align on the edge. And I'm just checking as I zoom in here. It's a little bit misaligned there on the front. And I think my balcony just needs a bit of editing. Okay, so what I can do in that case, now I've got it all in the one scene, is I can use the selection tool and I want to edit the um, upstairs. So I'm going to double click on the upstairs and I can actually edit the upstairs separately from the downstairs. You can see the downstairs has gone kind of greyish. So I'm going to use the selection tool and I'm going to select the line that I want to edit which is this blue line here. Move the move tool and I just want to align it. There. Another thing I want to do is add another balcony at the back over this one here. So I'm going to use the rectangle tool and from here I'm going to come out along here and then just add a balcony like that. Now you can see it's filled in the doorway here. That's not really a problem. We just check the inside and make sure it looks good. Use a selection tool. Select that door. Push delete and you can see I have a balcony, actually let's deselect everything. I have a balcony that comes out over my ground floor. I've aligned the top floor and the ground floor 